Well, jigs are one of the most popular artificial baits out there. So for this week's edition of Fishing Tips, Ray and Mandy teach us about the different kinds of jigs and which one is best to use on the water this summer. Hello again, everybody. I'm Ray Gildow, and tonight we're going to talk about an artificial bait that's the number one bait used, I think, across America for fishing, and that's jigs. And jigs come in just about every fashion, shape, color, size you can imagine. Uh, some of them come with little spinners on them like this, just as a little extra tractant. Some of them come that are floaters, they're like little floating jig heads, and you can use those with a little leader. Um, we have uh, some that are also hooked up with trailers, so you, if you've got a big shiner minnow on here and you're getting short bitten and you can't get that fish to bite the whole thing, you just stick that trailer into the back of the minnow and that'll set the hook and you can get them that way. We have a jig that's called a weed weasel, which is very popular in our part of the country. You can see there's a little plastic on that that protects that jig from that minnow uh, hook from getting cooked under the weeds, and that's called a weed weasel. And we have shiny, big eye, golden ones. You name it, we have um, a jig for almost everything. This is a jig for lake trout, and the, the bigger they are, the faster they fall, and the deeper you go. Lake trout, you can fish from 80 feet to 200 feet. And so there's all sizes, all shapes, and the, probably the number one item used for fishing. Mandy, what would you like to say? Obviously, they're versatile. Here again, every species possible, you can fish with them. But the cool part is they don't require live bait. They, you can pretty much put any plastic trailer on any kind of one of these jig heads and fish any species that you want. So what I've got before you guys is three of my absolute favorite go-to jigs. And on all three of these, I would use plastics. So if you see this one's got a, a particular little screw in it, that's great for anchoring that plastic that you're gonna put on this hook to help stay attached. So you can use this as, as a worm um, or pretty much any other trailer. This is a mushroom head jig. These things are, are, are deadly, largey, smallies. Walleyes here again, you can put the Mr. Twister tail on it. Uh, any kind of plastic that you want, you can get them in, in different weights too. And then a smaller size, uh, here this would be great for a little uh, twister tail that you could use for crappie and or bass and walleye. You can find jigs at any bait shop, any uh, hardware store. Jump off there and try them if you haven't been using them. Try them, they really do work. I'm Ray Gildaw with the Missoula Guides League. And I'm Mandy Year, the Bass and Biologist. Lakeland News is member supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.